Let's freaking go, baby. Oh, he's going to charge at us, huh? Oh, yeah, real good charge there, Mr. Smasher. Well, I think our question got answered very, very quickly. Who, Who's the stronger one? I think it's going to be the 11-round V6 RPG firing freaking madness weapon. All right, ladies and gents. So I have chosen my weapon. This is the weapon of choice, and we're going to be going through the perks together. So... You can't go all too mental with this weapon, but what I've realized is there's no way to increase the magazine size, you know, how much ammo we can have with this weapon. I am going to give this thing a huge reload speed and, and a disgusting amount of reload speed. And then obviously um, we're going to whack this over to energy because, well, I just like being able to kill every kind of husk obviously we're just going to keep the damage to afflicted targets as this weapon is going to cause affliction damage for six seconds uh we don't need a crit damage so we're actually going to change that to damage to mist monsters and bosses and there we go that is our legendary perked up v6 launcher it's a weapon that i haven't used for a I think the last time I used it might be one of my first uploads where it came out and I've made a video on it. And I don't think I've ever used it since. Alright, so let's have a look at the build that I'm going for. So we're going to be using Skull Trooper Jonesy and that is because we're going to get locked and reloaded which after reloading increases the weapon damage by 15% and the fire rate by 35% for 5 seconds. We're not going to be switching weapons, we're just going to be reloading it extremely fast and then firing off as much as possible. And then for my support Support heroes we have survivalist jonesy you know like to keep our health up during these big battle fights battle beat because i think we're going to be killing 10 enemies in nine seconds which will give us an increase of 50 percent more damage if we do manage to set it off explosive rounds i don't know if this is gonna work and i don't know if i'm gonna see it work because we're gonna be firing explosions left right and center but i thought well if we could just get extra explosions in on an explosion frenzy already <laughs> That's a 10. Faster explosions. Well, it doesn't mean faster explosions. It means increased launcher damage. So that is basically, you know, pretty obvious. And then Waste Not One is going to increase the magazine. And then Waste Not One, we're just going to increase the clip size on this launcher. And like I said, there was no perks to increase the size of this. So I was actually kind of curious. At some point, I might switch Waste Not One and Skull Trooper and see how it is like vice versa. I, ideally, I like to keep my missions in 140. But I also only really like doing these weapon reviews in a eliminate and collect or encampment mission. They seem to be the most fun for me. And are we on private? I hope we're on private. Yes, we are. Let's 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 get off private, public, and now we can do it. All right, let's craft ourselves one of these bad boys, then, shall we? I, I'm gonna get the feeling we might need a couple of them because, um, well, you know, we're probably gonna be going through them pretty quickly. Alright, here we freaking go. Let me just fire a few. Oh my god, just fire away, boy! Okay, so I like how our launcher has seven, seven rounds rather than eight. So not only is the... Hold on a minute, where's the fire pit? Hold on, what, what's happened here then? Oh my, okay, let's just keep firing away. Oh, okay. When we when we speed that, oh, <laughs> we speed it up, and it actually gets a little bit mental. Right. I'm not gonna lie though. Back when I first used this weapon, I'm pretty sure when you shot the floor, it would make a fire pit, and the fire pit would stay. And that was sort of the unique perk. Oh, oh yeah, Aiden, the the unique perk. Okay, but the magazine size is eight, and I have seven in my inventory, whilst also wielding. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, I don't think the fire is going to work too well against the fire husks. But the extreme rate at which we will be firing is a different story. Oh my god. Okay, that was some naughty fire rate. <laughs> Wait, can we hold it? Oh my god, we can hold it, can we? <laughs> okay, I'm... We are burning through ammo. Excuse me, friends. Oh, here. Oh, my goodness. Here we go. Oh, look at these. They've come to the party. They've come to the right place. Don't act like you have friends, husks. There we go. Are we clean? I mean, we are clearing the husks pretty damn quickly and pretty damn easily. I'm just so confused to 
what I expected with this weapon is com just it's not what I was expecting. I, you can tell I'm completely gobsmacked. So what's the durability on this weapon looking like? Mm -hmm. Okay, we're about a quarter of the way through and we've played about, I don't know, a quarter of this mission. So we're looking at about one, one per mission if we get a little bit rowdy. <laughs> oh, you, I mean, you've got to love a launcher like this, eh? How's this not a matter at the Storm King? Just popping off V6s willy-nilly. There we go. Look, look at this. Imagine that's the Storm King. He's just been absolutely obliterated. 180 over here. This guy doesn't even know what's up. Oh, my. You think you're big, man. Look at this. No! What are they doing, nature husks? You're about to get wrecked real quick. I mean, the thing is, we're slaying all the husks so quickly. Oh, actually, here we go. This might be good to use the reload. Reload all the way up into that next one. Reload. Change. Fire. Oh, my God. My teammate's probably like, what the? What is he firing? What's he got? And I'm like, listen, man. I got a V6 with two reload speeds. Right, look, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, reload is literally like a second and a half. Oh my goodness, yes. Whatever that is, I want some of that. Oh my goodness, sometimes the rapid fire just goes off. Oh, that wasn't great. <laughs> wow. Okay, that was pretty damn cool. And we're doing some pretty good damage, to be fair. Like, this isn't a full damage build. Oh, there we go. Look, we activated our perk. <laughs> Friends! I don't have much ammo left. Oh, I, I have no... Oh, my God. I've run out of um, coal and keg. That's not great. Oh, God. That is <laughs> How do we do? I mean, we've done a good amount of damage, man. Had old Ragnarok there running around willy-nilly, trying to bang the floor, trying to get some outlander kills. Our utility was nearly 1,800 due to the fact that we have to craft so many rockets. Yes, this series is how do we deplete aid and ammo sources faster than people can get to... I don't know. You naughty, naughty. You teasing me. So if we switch out our... Skull Trooper for our Waste Not Womp. Okay, so the magazine size now says 11. We only have a limited amount of ammo to practice with. So let's see. Well, not practice. Let's even see if we can fire off more than six shots. Here we go. Let's test it on this bad boy. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. <gasps> okay, so when we actually use Spitfire... We actually get that 11 mag. Oh my goodness. That's a... Uh, if you... <laughs> if you've got coal to spare and you're trying to use it up, well, here's your build. This is the build that you want, Mr. Coal Factory Owner. Goddamn Santa Claus over here. Right, well, let's go take it to an encampment then. I mean, we saw how we literally went through nearly 20 shots there down to 85 so um, I'm gonna try and be a little bit more reasonable but I really like the fact that this has an 11 clip now or magazine I don't know the difference come on now like what the hell do you even call it on a rocket launcher right let's uh, let's go warm up these husky husks come on boop boop here we go oh my goodness fire real quick huh oh that was that was some madness okay let's rinse and repeat Oh my goodness gracious me, there is literally no delay between explosion. Other than me choosing to, that, that's, that's, that's real. Oh my goodness, off with your head. Ah uh, yes, lovely house, and then we're just gonna fire away, and uh, this house is basically gone. Okay, and there's no longer a house. Um, <clears throat> I'm just gonna leave, that wasn't me. So we're gonna wait for a war cry, and then we're gonna unleash hell upon this uh, smasher here. Uh, this got down right shield noob excellent right there is a husky husk there but we're not worried okay we've got 36 shots is it going to be enough to destroy the smasher well we're about to find out it's either us or the smasher let's freaking go baby oh he's going to charge at us huh oh yeah real good charge there mr smasher well i think our question got answered very very quickly who who's the stronger one 
I think it's going to be the 11 round V6 RPG firing freaking madness weapon. And uh, to be honest, it's no surprise that a weapon that uses so much ammo could even be bad. I'm going to have to go farming for some coal. That's what I'm going to have to do. You know you can do this right and you can hit all of them. Let's just pretend that in the world of Save the World there was a duplication glitch and some people may have taken advantage of it. They might have thousands upon thousands of kegs of barrels of coal and all that malarkey. They're like, hmm, how could one use all of this effectively? And I would say, hey, you need to go grab a V6 launcher and give it two times reload speed and run around just obliterating every single husk in all the modes. Obviously, I have no idea how much this explosive round support perk played because, well, there's explosions every second when you're using the V6. And uh, I wasn't really keeping track of every sixth range kill giving me an additional explosion. But there we have it, ladies and gents. That is going to bring us to the end of this rapid-firing V6 launcher. If you enjoyed it, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe and comment down below what builds you would like to see in the next video. I'm doing different builds, different weapons. I'm doing everything that is just out the ordinary, just basically insane, and I love it because it's just the madness of this game that I enjoy. And if you want to support me, you can use my supporter credit code Aiden Harris on screen now, and you can use that whenever buying llamas, emotes, and or skins. You're going to get mad mythics if you use my code. It's, it's basically fact at this point. And on that note, I hope you're drinking water, meditating, exercising, taking care of yourselves, and I will see you all in the next one. Adios. Damn boy, he said!